Hello guys, it's Crank. So uh, before we start uh, the video today, uh, question of the day, I want to know everyone's favorite Brawlhalla color um, on any legend. Personally, for me, it got be Gala. You know, it got be Gala. Gala's for the carry um, <laughs> on any legend, but like, it doesn't matter. Um, just comment down below which you prefer and see if people agree with you. Uh, onto the video. So today we are going to talk about Cassie. Um, now beforehand, I just want to say if you enjoy videos like these, please leave a like. And if you want to, you can sub for more future content, which I do plan on playing out on more characters. Uh, that I'm going to do <laughs> with uh. The rest of the legends uh and i just post like funny clips sometimes and i do live stream uh around the night time around 9 p.m eastern um but yeah we are trying to hit 1000 subs this year uh anything will help onto the video this is cassidy the weapons she uses is the hammer and guns. Cassie is the second legend that was in the official game of Brawlhalla when launched. If the OGs will only know her true power back then. But anyways, her default stats are 6 strength, 8 dexterity, which is very good for a character like her and for her weapons she has. And last but not least, she has four defense and speed on both categories. We will be talking about different levels she uses and what takes what away later on it in the video. Oh my God. You guys, he literally has a fat ass and I want to smack it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, Cassie is usually seen as a legend with both good signatures and kill options. She is good for newer players and even better for veterans. Her dexterity, like I said earlier, is very good for her weapons that need the dexterity for combos or stacking combos on the player you have to kill. So those old grim players though <laughs> you have to deal with in comp but we won't get onto them okay um but there's more to that her guns are very good for a quick attacking weapon for an aggressive play style she's very good great for combos and even have white future so below now let's go on to the pros and cons within cassidy Cassidy spam. Cassie six are very good, but can be easily punishable if you don't know how to use them right. Her down sig on both weapons are very, very good. Some people say there is some problems with them, but. I usually don't see any problems with either of them when I use them. Her speed is kind of slow. So if you want to be very movemental a lot, I don't think she will be the perfect fit for you. But that doesn't mean not using her at all. She is a good pick for beginner players. Great for veterans. In the game yes i'm talking to you more dex mains <laughs> but i think that's really all i got for pros and cons and now we will be going on towards her forms which is her defense and everything now her forms which is uh the defense will take away 8 dexterity and turn into a 7. I usually use this for Cassie because I don't worry about the dex. 
if it's over five but now the speed takes away one defense well, it isn't that bad of a takeaway I, I do think this is a good pick as well now strength takes away one speed i don't recommend this neither does the sad slug magnar players you know who you are uh i'm just saying but uh <laughs> and last but not least the dexterity takes strength which isn't that bad as well if you want that max dexterity which is nine but that's pretty much it now for the next part we will go on with Ooh, be her six now cassidy's hammer six oh my god i love her hammer her side default will be doing 25 just like bodefar in the last video if you want to go check that out good for close range if it can get held onto 31 damage so that pretty much means if you hold the sig for the whole time the max damage you will do is 31 and you include that with the knockback if they are orange they probably will get ko'd with that so i think that's a very good thing for her i love the hitbox for the sig uh including which is the next sig uh, down sig the down sig deals 36 but if they are in the tornado the whole time and so pretty much that what that means is if they're in to the tornado that whole time uh throughout the sig it will do deal 36 damage now if they're in the tornado the whole time uh while it's holded down with a down sick, it will deal 42 and a half damage if you hold it down the whole time though. Her now we're going to her, her neutral sig. Uh one of the best sigs in my opinion for a hammer, uh, which is Cassie's neutral sig. Um it comes in at 21. Uh pretty pretty much the hitbox on this thing it's it's just beautiful if you know how to use that rope if you know how to use it it's very good for counter attacks or reading she will be one of the go-to's for you and i promise you that if you hold this sick down this will be deal dealing 25 damage which is very good for a neutral sig like hers because you can use it like a scythe you can use it like armis's uh neutral sig you can use it like armis's uh for lance that is and you can use it uh like all the other neutral sigs you can use it very good for reading in my opinion but now we're going to go into the blasters okay so the blasters side sig default will do 28 which is mainly good for counters and close range hold it down will be dealing 33 damage down sig does 26 default uh hold it down will do 31 and this varies on what position they will be onto i think i tested it out from the farthest angle i'm not so sure about the rest of the um areas if they get hit in that but i do fr know from the farthest angle is 26. now her neutral does 23 to up to 24 depending from the height where the sig is used hold it down will be doing 26 to 28 depending same thing depending from the height when the sig is used so what that pretty much means is how far they are from that sig it, it varies you can probably hit a 23 if they're a little bit farther up but for that max damage, they can be like dropping right on you. 24 
uh, and a half is very good for her. Um, but yeah, those are pretty much all of her six collected throughout uh, the blasters and the hammer. And I definitely love how these played out. Now I think that's mainly it for the video. We went over her stats, background, her main uses, pros and cons, the six and forms she uses with her weapon. I do think in a tier list she is A. She's is very good but considering her speed and defense and how many people can be a better use in 2v2 in comp in general i think she's a good character if you know how to truthfully use those weapons uh which is the hammer and the blasters I consider you to use her in a 1v1 comp. If you did enjoy this video, consider dropping a like and subscribe for more content like this. Uh, or related to this, which is uh, like Valorant videos, I'll probably go into depth after this series. Um, but yeah, this is Cranks signing out.